Hi, my name is Manjeet Man and I'm the author of Whirly Twirly Me, my new picture book which is out in August. And it's all about a young person who's, well she's going through some pretty whirly twirly feelings throughout her day and she doesn't quite understand them and she's feeling a little bit misunderstood as well because as we all know some days can bring big feelings. So it's out in August, I really hope you pick it up and read it and enjoy. Thanks so much. So the inspiration behind Whirly Twirly Me is, um, well really, my childhood and the whirly twirly feelings that I would feel when I was little. And to be honest, the whirly twirly feelings that I felt as an adult as well. Because we can all feel angry and sad and a whole host of emotions from day to day and sometimes we don't understand why and sometimes we're quite misunderstood as well. Um, so yeah, so it's really inspired by the feelings that I feel from day to day. Um, as I'm really hoping that any young person who reads this book um, will see that it's, it's okay. It's okay to feel whirly-twirly sometimes, to feel angry, feel sad and not quite know why and not really understand yourself. I'm really hoping that Whirly Twirly Me will help you um, understand maybe where those feelings are coming from because it's okay. It's okay to feel different from day to day because it's all part of being whirly twirly you. And here's a short reading from Whirly Twirly Me. I hope you enjoy. When I woke up, it looked like a normal day, but it didn't feel like a normal day. I felt a bit whirly, my insides a bit twirly, my stomach in a knot, the knot had me in a strop, the strops got me in a flop. And then, at breakfast, my big sister finishes my favourite cereal. Now it's all gone. I can't help it. I start to feel a bit whirly. My insides a bit twirly, my stomach in a knot. I'm in a strop and a flop all the way to school. Mum says, I'll get some more cereal later. No need to get angry. I say... But I'm not just angry. Things get worse at school. Callum takes my favourite red pencil. My cheeks feel flushed and my face feels hot. And then comes the whirl, the twirl, the not strop flop. Mrs Gill speaks softly. It's okay. Callum just borrowed your pencil. No need to get angry. I say but I'm not just angry. And if you want to find out what happens next, you'll have to read Whirly Twirly Me. Thanks so much.